。跟住到第八條就問我哋啦，喺個光合作用嘅邊一個步驟底下啦，係需要咧有呢個 ATP 嘅能量輸入嘅。咁其實咧，根據翻第六、第七條咧，我哋啱啱先講完咧，作為一個需要能量嘅過程咧，佢應該係一個 anabolic 嘅 reaction， 係一個砌嘢嘅過程嚟嘅。咁所以咧，其實咧，我哋睇翻呢個三個步驟咧，邊一個係砌嘢咧，我哋大約咧都估得到答案㗎啦。咁啊，即管睇一睇咯喎。咁我哋先睇第一個嘅 process 就係 fixation of carbon dioxide and formation of the free C compound。咁呢個係 Kelvin cycle 嘅第一步嚟㗎嘛，由一個 CO2 能住。一個五 C c o m p o u n 一加五就為之六，然後咧就將呢個六 C 嘅 c o m p o u n 咧就變成兩個三 C 嘅 c o m p o u n 擺到明係拆嘢啦，係嘛？咁但我哋頭先係講咗砌嘢先要吸能量啊嘛，咁所以佢就一定唔會係吸能量啦。一咧就已經錯咗，錯咗，錯咗，錯咗，所以答案已經係 C 噶啦。不過有啲體育精神咧，搞掂埋，剩低嗰兩個答案啫。第二個啦 ，reduction of free C compound leading to the formation of glucose。呢度要做啲咩嘢啊？我有個 free C compound， 要做 reduction。咩叫 reduction 啊？還原啊，還原最基本嘅概念呢，就係加個輕俾你 ，addition of hydrogen。咁要加嘢，加嘢係咪砌嘢？加嘢梗係砌嘢啦。咁所以啦，自不然佢就係一個 anabolic reaction 啦。咁所以啦，佢係需要咧有能量嘅參與嘅。咁第二呢，又已經正確咗啦。跟住到第三呢 r e g e n e r a t i o n of 一個。carbon dioxide 嘅 receptor， 其實啦，當中咧就唔係所有嘅三 C c o m p o u n 咧都會變曬做呢個 carbohydrate 嘅個 glucose 嘅，而係有一部分咧係會攞嚟重新製造翻咧變成呢個 five C 嘅 carbon dioxide receptor。咁所以你睇翻個 reaction 咧，佢都係攞一啲三 C 咧去冚翻出變成五 C 嘅。當然你會覺得奇怪嚇，三 C 加三 C 係六 C 喎，兩 Sir 點解會砌到個五出嚟啊？咁其實咧，我哋就係用翻十個嘅三 C。就砌咗成為咧六個嘅五 C 出嚟嘅，咁所以咧數字上仍然係吻合，咁即係話啦，砌嘢啦，砌嘢咪即係 anabolic activity 咯，咁 anabolic activity 要唔要能量啊？要啊嘛，咁所以啦，原來咧佢都需要有呢個 ATP 嘅協助嘅，所以答案就係 C 啦。So for question eight is talking about which of the following processes in photosynthesis require energy input from the ATP. So if we Uh, talk about the question six and seven. We know that for the anabolic activity, building up activity, we need the energy input, right? So that's why for the statement one, two, three. So what we just need to take a look is which of them is really building up something. So for the option one, fixation of carbon dioxide and the formation of three C compound. So according to the reaction, we can see that CO two, the one C compound. Plus the five C compound to become the six C compound, but the six C compound they will be broken down into two three C compound. So obviously, it's a breakdown reaction. It's not a anabolic activity. So that's why it is not the answer. And somehow we can see that option A, B, D they are wrong. So the final answer should be C. So let's take a look at statement number two and three as well. So for statement number two is talking about the reduction of the three C compound, leading to the formation of the glucose. So we can see that we have the three C compound. Later on, there is a six C compound. So at least there should be three C plus three C, right? So and for this concept, we need to talk about the reduction. What does it mean for reduction? In chem in the chemistry concept, it's talking about the addition of hydrogen atom. So that's why building up, right? It is a building up act activity. So also from the book, you can see that there is ATP energy input. So the second reaction is correct. And for the number three is for the regeneration of the carbon dioxide acceptor. So that means the five C compound. So not. All triphosphate, the three C compound, will be converted into glucose, and some of them they will be used to regenerate the five C compound. So you may think that no, Mr. Lam, three C plus three C, it should be six C. But my target is five C. So actually, the numbers should be they are ten three C compound to become thirty C, and they will be regenerated to six five C compound. So also thirty. Carbons, so that's why it's still a anabolic reactions. So that's why number three is also correct, and the final answer is C.